Hi guys, Arnold Broad here with another news update on men's health and in this issue we want to talk about erectile dysfunction and a natural cure. If you have any questions about this video or any of the videos on my channel, just give me a call or text me at 609-410-4790. If you'd like to see other videos that I've done, especially on ED, then just click on some of the links in the description below this video. Now let's see what we have today. Now, I don't want to say that erectile dysfunction is reaching epidemic proportions, but if you're like me and you're a constant viewer of literature on ED, it's hard to come to any other conclusions. Right now, in the U.S. alone, there are between 20 and 25 million men with erectile dysfunction. 50% of men with diabetes have erectile dysfunction and 40 to 50 percent of men over the age of 60 have erectile dysfunction. Now there are two major reasons for this increase in ED rates and one is the graying of the population so as men get older they are more at risk and more likely to have erectile issues. However the other major cause and how it's tied into aging is lifestyle issues and the less we take care of ourselves the worse our health becomes and then all systems of the body are are affected so that it's not so much that we're growing older that has an effect on ED it's that as we grow older we have a longer period of time to have our lifestyle choices affect our physical body Now, the main cause of erectile dysfunction is poor blood flow, and primarily poor blood flow to the penis because that's what makes an erection happen. Now, one of the major factors in poor blood flow is damage to the cardiovascular system and primarily to the lining of the blood vessels. The lining of the blood vessels is called the endothelium, and the endothelium produces something called nitric oxide. And nitric oxide is really important in your body for many reasons, keeping your blood pressure in control, keeping your cholesterol issues in control, and it has a major importance to erectile dysfunction. The better your nitric oxide levels, the easier it is to have an erection, the easier it is to maintain an erection. Now there are a number of medical interventions to get your blood pressure and your blood sugar under control which are some of the damaging causes to the endothelium to the lining of your blood vessels but many of these medical interventions which are primarily pills come with many nasty side effects. There are also many natural ways to control your blood pressure and blood sugar and they primarily center on lifestyle changes, exercise, proper nutrition, maintaining a proper weight. And proper nutrition generally means cutting out much, most of, if not all of, the junk foods that we add into our diet. And adding in fruits and vegetables and non-processed foods and whole grains, many of the foods that you find on the Mediterranean diet or the DASH diet. Unfortunately, lifestyle changes are very difficult to initiate and very difficult to maintain. Now there's something called nitric oxide therapy, which is really, really good in healing the lining of the blood vessels, healing the endothelium so that your body can naturally produce nitric oxide on its own. Nitric oxide therapy is a easy therapy to do. There are no side effects and it's great in maintaining blood pressure, maintaining cholesterol uh, levels and helping with erectile dysfunction. 
Now, if you'd like to see a really good video on nitric oxide therapy, then just click on the link in the description below this video. If you have any questions about nitric oxide therapy, about this video or any of the videos on my channel, give me a call or text me at 609-410-4790. I want to thank you for stopping by and watching this video. Have a great day, and here's to your good health.